ya chuku no gaza bo ya chuku no gaza yere meza ya obioma bo ya chuku no gaza one more time i am a winner in the lord jesus i am a winner in the are you a winner i am a winner in the lord jesus yo 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 Weto, we now, we now, we now, we now. Africa, you know we do, we now. What are, what are you going forever? We, one more time. We now, we now, we now, we now. Africa, you know we know, we now. What are, what are you going forever? We now. Uh, <laughs> I'm telling you. <laughs> <laughs> Amazing, amazing. Yes, and sad. Ah, ah. This Afcon, mm. this Afcon that just ended has, has, I mean, it has, it has created an eye opener. Mm. Mm? The prodigal sons have started coming back. Wow. I'm sorry, he's not actually a prodigal son. I'm just using that to equate what has happened. Yeah, yeah, I'm talking yeah, about yeah. Ato mm. Okonkwo, mm. who just switched nationalities mm. and came back to his ancestral home. Mm. Eh? Okonkwo Abialulo. Mm. He's back home. Yes, so this is amazing. Super amazing. Amazing. So when, amazing. When, when the news came in, I was just excited. Mm. Judging from where this guy has come from, and then um, being, of course, he's an Arsenal player who is on loan at Wrexham mm. and all that. So what are your thoughts on this on this amazing young man? When when I saw the news, you know the song that came to my mind, come home, come home. <laughs> oh, welcome back, welcome home. We are blessing you with all arms open mm. okay mm. you're a fine guy out there you've been doing exploits you've been playing good football out there mm. we understand that uh, some person will like oh, come on afcon has brought you in oh come on don't worry come home come home you guys out there come home mm. we want more of you some person will be like eh what about you now we already have one but we don't need any other person my brother my, my sister my injuries can occur Okay, and it, it, it makes more sense when you have quality everywhere. Mm. So come and get your place, come and battle for your position. After, if, if, in fact, for him, he's 22. What if he gets drafted in, into the Olympic uh, team and all that? Come on, guys, come home. Mm. Africa is your home. Come on, let's play this football. People are there in Europe playing their own. Let's play our own. Okay, mm. so it's, it's, it's so amazing. What a victory! Mm. What a victory! Mm. And see. News even making rounds too is saying that Maduka Okoye, remember Maduka yes, Okoye? Yes, of course, of course, um, of course. yes, he has some issues with the, uh, uh, will I say, some errors. And errors are okay, or errors can happen rather. Mm. And uh, due to those errors that he had during the last Nations Cup against Tunisia, that uh, Nigeria lost, and since then he has not been invited. What did he say? He said that he felt hard feelings watching the AFCON from home and not playing. See, we want that competition. Bring this guy. Let's de let them compete. When the they are bringing out 40 man list, bring the best. Let them compete for their position. That is what we are talking about, okay? Yes. This is big news. I thought he's a fine goalkeeper. Mm. You cannot take it away from this guy. This guy grew, grew from the ranks. He has been coached by the best hands out there. Mm. From the Arsenal young very young team as in children kindergarten team that was how he has been rising and rising and rising right now he yes he's still an national player but then on loan to rexham and guess what even in the rexham he has played up to 21 games and nine clean sheets that is a vine goalkeeper mm -hmm. league two is not a joke especially in rexham and they have been doing so so well rexham has been doing well and he's there doing his bidding so mm -hmm. welcome back welcome back i know that more persons more persons will come in and join. This guy is a fine keeper, 22 years of age, tall. He is wide. He can cover up his spaces. He's good with the ball uh, on the ground. What a fine keeper. These are the guys that we want. Let them keep coming. Okay? So, because congratulations to, to um, uh, the, the Nigerian Football, um, uh, uh, the NFF, Nigerian Football Federation. Big congratulations to Africa as a whole. And thank you, thank you, FIFA, for granting this permission to Arthur Okonkwo to join his country home, the green, white green. Obviously, obviously, we are so grateful. Now, moving forward, now let's talk about this Arthur Okonkwo. Now, let's um, 
see <clears throat> how do you see him fitting into the team? Because I know I know uh, we if everybody is still trying to recover from the heroics of Stanley Wabali, and uh, we know that despite the fact Nigeria didn't win the African Cup of Nations, Stanley Wabali was a hero, saved Nigeria on several occasions, and we see the heroics this man has done. So if Tomorrow now, uh, Ato has come into the team now. And then, how do you see him fitting in? Now, let's forget about the fact that uh, injury might occur to Stanley Wabale, but let's, how do you think he can fit into the team? Um, I know that um, competitions are out there. Look at uh, Ojo of uh, Eyimba. Ah. <laughs> He's still there. You see, we have not even mentioned him. <laughs> <laughs> He's still there. Madoka is also saying, please, I want to come back home. I want to come back to the Super Eagles. Okay? Ozoho, who knows? Ozoho might also go go out there within the next uh, one and a half year do so much wonder for his league even move to a better club and what the what what are we talking about he might also be um challenging the the top spot so what are we saying well um for Arthur to <laughs> overtake everybody like that or more it is near impossible not that it's not possible but it's near um impossible so um he should uh, also he has to play his time uh, one Bali my, is one of those lucky guys out there that didn't really get tested, but then yeah, it just yeah. happened. And remember, that's the same way that it happened for um, Iyama. Yeah, so, Iyama. Yeah, so it might just happen that way. But then it's good to hang around. Even if you are not the third best, you may be around the fourth best waiting for your time so that if anything happened between first, second, and third, you can now squeeze yourself and in. show yourself. Uh -huh, and show yourself. And it might just be it for him. But then for him just automatically entering into that top three, I'm not talking about top goalkeeper. Even the top three might be difficult for him, but then he has age. And you know, footballers, uh, goalkeepers also have long span. You can be a goalkeeper till uh, age 38, mm. but then we know that Nigeria it does not happen because the last time that we had a very old, old, <laughs> Peter Rufai, at the time they said that he, he has eye problems. Eye problem. <laughs> okay, you remember that time? <laughs> that they say one shot, that he did not know he was seeing three balls. <laughs> <laughs> sorry, but sorry, then, we are just... <laughs> but then we don't we don't want our goalkeepers at, at above thirty five. I beg because uh, you know now nah, it is mm. well. <laughs> yes, uh, obviously it, it is well. Yeah. All right, to you our viewers who are watching this for the first time, this is football intel. Amazing, amazing content we are creating right here in the studio. If you're watching this for the first time and you want to be a part of this and keep seeing this coming, just below your screen you have the subscribe button. Click on it, activate the notification bell, and of course, be up to date with our latest release. And to you, our family members and subscribers who have been watching, we say a big thank you to you guys. Thank you for the likes. Thank you for the shares. Thank you for the comments. And of course, one more thing before I forget this. Now, for every other move now, with what uh, has happened to Ato Okonkwo, we are going to keep tax on our brothers who are in Europe, especially those people with Nigerian descent. So as many of them that shall be switching nationalities to Nigeria, we here at Football Intel, guess what? We will keep you guys updated on every move, every move, as far as it concerns switching nationalities to Nigeria. We are going to keep you guys updated. So all you just have to do is once you sense anything, Come on, just come straight to the page and you get to watch content that I we even, create. I, I would say we might even extend it to the whole of Africa. We okay, have the okay. energy. Yes, the of whole course, of Africa. Of course, definitely. As they are switching in, we are switching uh, nationalities. We should be able to give yes, them yes, obviously. no matter the time. Obviously. Yeah, so yeah. you can see here, we mean business yeah. right here in Football Intel. It's really amazing. This year, we, we told you guys now, we are not joking. Yeah. We were not joking. 2024, we know mm. go. That is just what we are doing here. We have, this is just the beginning. You ain't seen nothing yet. So keep liking, keep sharing. Keep commenting, keep commenting because your comments help us to know how you feel about the content which we create, ways we can improve, you know, constructive criticism and all that. And we promise to make sure that everything you guys comment, we take it to heart and make improvements where they are necessary because we here are here for you guys. Thank you so much for being part of this. We love you. I love you. Mr. Victor loves you. We all love you, the crew and everybody who's responsible for making this wonderful content. We love you guys and we will keep giving you the best. Until we come your way again next time, I remain your host, Dominion Chooks. And of course, he still remains our top soccer analyst, Mr. Victor. Saying bye for now.